Well, new this morning, the Salvation Army is making a bold move to help local families in need. The organization is kicking off its annual Red Kettle campaign two months early. 13 on your side's Angela Cunningham is live this morning with what's behind this unusual move. Good morning, Angela. Good morning. Unusual, but definitely understandable. The Salvation Army is one of those places people have turned to for help since the start of this pandemic. Now leaders here are concerned what that increased demand could mean moving forward. That is the one reason behind this early start and this proactive approach. The Red Kettle campaign typically runs around Christmas in November and December. This year it starts pretty much now. Leaders anticipate having to help 155% more people nationally over the holidays, all while bracing for a 50% decrease in red kettle donations. They believe that drop will happen because of more retail stores closing this year, less traffic in stores that are open, consumers carrying less money, and simply more people struggling financially. Now, you're not going to see those red kettles out in your community for a few more weeks now. However, you can immediately donate on by mail or either phone or calling in your donations. Coming up in the next half hour, we will speak once again with Divisional Commander Major Glenn Caddy about how they are committed to helping those in need in our community during this pandemic. For now, back to you. Angela, thank you so much. They do so much good for this community. More good news for the Salvation Army this Thursday. The Croc Center will reopen to members. The fitness center has been closed since March.